Welcome back, guys. In this video, we're breaking down a Canadian biotech story with none other than its founder and CEO, Mark Upstell. Rapid Dose Therapeutics says that they're changing drug delivery. Let's figure out how. So, Mark, uh, for investors who may be completely new here to Rapid Dose, what top point makes the company a compelling investment opportunity? So, we've developed game changing technology that will deliver almost any molecule you would find in your medicine cabinet today. This is developed through an oral thin film strip. What we've done is created an oral thin film that comes in a single pouch such as this. It's a melatonin. When you open this up, it creates a strip such as this. This strip goes under your tongue and will dissolve in under 15 seconds and deliver the medication sublingually right into your bloodstream. What's the um, addressable market here? And can you also talk about specific market segments that you see as having the highest growth potential? Yeah, there are a couple of key categories that's important to us. Uh, one is the nicotine strip we've been working on for uh, approximately three years and developed various formulations for this. Um, the nicotine market is growing, but the reduction in smoke and harm reduction is very key. Uh, by 2030, uh, they're expecting the non-smoking division to be $20.3 billion. And right now, um, that is a big jump from where the current marketplace is. And this is according for the latest data by uh, global data. The other key to thing that is important to us is the dental market. When you go to the dentist, so let's say you've got a filling to have treated, you'll get a topical gel they'll put on, this, on your cheek or in your area to be treated, and then they'll give you a needle. We've created that strip to go in the area to be treated to reduce the topical gel and eliminate the needle in a lot of cases. This is to provide pain-free dentistry and the consumer and the patient and the dentist um, are extremely excited about this, uh, as well as we are, as this new product. Well, can you give us details about your IP portfolio, any trade secrets that make your tech defensible against other potential competitors? Yeah, so we're, there's a small number of companies in this marketplace. Uh, we're expecting more and, and, and welcome them. Um, one of the areas is uh, you know, awareness of the, of the strip versus uh, other delivery systems, uh, such as needles or pills. So what we've created is the, is the functionality to deliver this medication through the strip. Uh, we've built locations um, based on regulatory issues or licensing. And that's one of the areas that is important to, uh, to keep as it, uh, as it relates to trade secrets. Well, I know we've been focusing here on the strip in this interview, but you do have other revenue streams according to your website. Can you quickly walk us through what they are and also what your path to uh, profitability looks like? Yes, yeah, so we've been working on R&D for about three years uh, to develop the technology. Uh, our growth pattern strategically is to align ourselves with global partners that are synergistic, i.e. big tobacco companies, pharmaceutical companies, um, and companies leverage that are already in the game. Um, because of our technology is so universal, uh, we're excited about uh, you know, strategic partnerships. Can you uh, give us any names? What kind of partnerships, uh, licensing deals you're working on? So one of the key things we're doing right now is we partnered with the NFL and the uh, University of Regina to do a clinical study on pain management. We're taking high percentage CBD and targeting 18 to 30 year old uh, male football players. And these football players have various things such as PTSD, uh, anxiety, pain management, concussions, and so on. And so they're developing a program, we're halfway through it, that will address um, blood draws every 15 minutes to enable and show uh, what this uh, study will provide for pain management uh, for these athletes uh, for the future. Now, last question, or last few questions. Uh, what what uh, key catalysts can we watch for over the next 12 to 24 months or so? So one of our key objectives is to make the Quickstrip brand available in various market segments. So when you walk into a, a gas and convenience or a grocery store, you'll see a Quickstrip on the shelf. That would contain melatonin, caffeine, B12, curcumin, et cetera, in that category. When you go to the dentist, you'll have a quick strip that you would be treated for uh, pain management and for dental procedures. Uh, alternatively, there will be other dental products that we have for things like dry mouth, people that have a hard time swallowing pills. When you go into the pharmacy, we will have, and we have uh, Vi Viagra and Cialis in the terms of sildenafil and Tadalafil uh, available. And then the last story would be the nicotine, when you have a nicotine product, you'd see at the at stores as well. So the strategy is brand awareness across multiple market segments, delivering 
different ingredients. And you say uh, you'll see it in pharmacy. Is that just in Canada or does it include other countries? Yes, we're starting in Canada right now. Uh, we have expanded some of our product sets uh, into other countries. And uh, Canada is a great test ground. Um, one of the things we talked about, too, was uh, you know, the barriers to entry that you mentioned. And one of the things that we looked at was tariffs. And tariffs right now, uh, it's, it's you know, in the news every day. And we took advantage of this back in November uh, to mitigate the risk of tariffs, uh, tariffs. What we did is we purchased about two years of raw materials uh, to make the products and the foil packaging that we, uh, that we print here um, in order to make sure that we're not uh, exposed to any of the fluctuation in that, uh, in that program. Well, we're going to have to leave it there, uh, Mark, but thank you for being here. Great. Thank you so much. Uh, that's Mark Upstell of Rapid Dose Therapeutics. Make sure to uh, follow CEO.ca and look at the company to see what other investors are saying. Thanks for watching.